Hello and welcome to this presentation of the STM32 interconnect matrix. It covers the main features of this matrix, which is widely used to connect various internal peripherals between each other. The interconnect matrix integrated inside STM32 products provides direct connections between peripherals. Applications benefit from these interconnections to ensure time-predictable operations, to decrease power consumption by avoiding complex management of peripheral communications through reading or writing registers using CPU instructions, and, in some cases, to reduce the need to loop the signal from a source to a destination through dedicated GPIOs. The interconnect matrix offers two main features. First, it ensures direct and autonomous connections between peripherals, allowing to remove latency in regards to software handling, thus saving GPIO and CPU resources. Secondly, the interconnection between peripherals operate during sleep mode. This slide indicates the list of source and destination peripherals. Source peripherals are EXDIs, timers, USARTs, analog IPs, clocks, RTC, and system error. Destination peripherals are timers, infrared interface, analog IPs, and DME MUX. The interconnect matrix is further described in the STM32C0 reference manual. This slide and the next one describe the various possible uses for the interconnect matrix. Synchronizing or chaining timers, for example, allowing a master timer to reset or trigger a second slave timer, triggering an ADC through a timer or EXDI event, triggering a timer through an ADC watchdog signal when a predefined threshold value is crossed by the analog input, calibrating HSI and LSI clocks, for example, measuring the external oscillator LSC frequency by a timer clocked by the calibrated internal oscillator. Other use cases, monitoring the temperature of a connected internal temperature sensor or VREF int, protecting timer-driven power switches through the direct connection of system error signals to the timer break input, infrared pulse modulation signal waveform generation using two timers, and triggering a DMA data transfer by a timer. This slide shows a simple example of timer synchronization. The timer 3 is used as the master timer and can reset, start, stop or clock the timer 1 configured in slave mode. In this example, timer 3 is clocking the timer 1 so that it acts as a prescaler for timer 1. The master mode selection field allows selected information to be sent in master mode to slave timers for synchronization. TRGO reset, enable, update, compare. In this example, the update option is selected. The slave mode selection field configures the slave mode operation. Disabled, encoder, reset, gated, external clock or combined reset. In this example, the external clock mode is selected. Peripherals can be interconnected using the interconnect matrix even when the circuit is in a low power sleep mode. Regarding the STM032C0, all supported interconnections between peripherals are functional in both run and sleep modes. For more details about the interconnect matrix, refer to the reference manual for STM32C0 microcontrollers. Refer also to the following presentations for more information if needed. Timers or TIM, analog to digital converter or ADC, extended interrupts and event controller or EXDI, DMA request multiplexer or DMA MUX, infrared interface or IR team, reset and clock control or RCC, and real-time clock or RTC. Thank you for attending this presentation.